Hello everyone and welcome back. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to build a map drill down with dynamic zone visibility. For example, I can click on California and I see sales and profit for each postcode within California. Click on a postcode and it goes back to the entire US. Let's see how we build it. For those of you that are new here, my name's Andy. I'm here to help you become great at Tableau. If you'd like to get a sneak peek at new content that I create, discounts on products and recaps and any other news that I have, sign up for my newsletter. Go to andycreeble.com, enter your name, and every Friday morning, you'll get all that information. There's a link in the description to the final workbook that I create in this video. I'm kindly asking for a one pound donation to help cover the costs of creating these videos for you. If not, you can simply follow along. Let's start by building our map of profit by state. Double click on the state field, drag profit to the color, and there we go we have our profit by state. Let's clean up the view. Right click in the map and choose background layers. Drag the washout over to 100%. Click on color, click on borders, and let's give them a white border. Right click in the map again and choose format. Go to the borders option, set the row divider to none and the column divider to none. And there we go, we have our state. Rename this sheet profit by state. Right click on the name of the sheet and choose duplicate. Now we want to create profit by postal code. Let's rename the sheet profit by postal code. Drag postal code onto the view as a mark layer. On the postal code tab, drag sales onto size and profit onto color. Click on the size shelf and make it as big as you want. Click on color, set the halo to none, and I'm going to set my border to white. Now go to the state option on the marks card. Drag profit off of the color, change the mark type to a map, click on color, let's set it to a lighter gray, and then set the border to a slightly darker gray. Now we need to begin to set up our dynamic zone visibility. We're gonna start by creating a parameter. Call this parameter state parameter. The data type is going to be a string. The current value, I'm gonna set the Florida, I like to enter a value in there so that when I go ahead and test it, I can see if it works right away. Click on OK. Create a calculated field. Call it state match. The calculation is state equals state parameter. Click on OK. Drag state match onto the filters of our profit by postal code sheet and choose true. And notice everything filters down to Florida. Go back to our profit by state sheet. We're going to create another calculated field. We're going to call this one state not selected. Here we're going to say the state parameter is equal to blank. So double quotes with no space in the middle. Click on OK. This is the field we're going to use for our dynamic zone visibility. Go to a new sheet. Drag on either a vertical or horizontal container. It doesn't matter which one. Drag profit by state into the container and drag profit by postal code next to it. Now I don't need any of this stuff on the right hand side. So I'm gonna highlight that, click on the X to remove it from the dashboard and choose delete containers. Click on the profit by state sheet, go to the layout tab, and here's the trick. Choose this option that says control visibility using value. In the dropdown, we're gonna pick state not selected. And notice we've now filtered down to Florida because Florida already existed. The last step is to set up our parameter action. Go up the dashboard, actions. We're gonna click on add action and change parameter. Call it update state parameter. We're gonna leave both sheets checked. In the target parameter, choose state parameter. In the source field, choose state. And in the clearing selection option, just choose set to value. We're gonna leave that blank. Click on okay, click on okay again. Now when I click on a postal code, it goes back to the state. Click on Nebraska and it goes to the postal codes for Nebraska. Go to California and we see the postal codes for California. And that's all there is to it. A simple map drill down using dynamic zone visibility. If you found this useful, please give it a like. And don't forget to click on subscribe. I don't want you to miss any of the content that I create. And again, don't forget to sign up for my newsletter at andycreeble.com. If you'd like access to this workbook, the link is in the description. Have a great day.